NASA's James Webb Space Telescope has astonished us with the most detailed images of Jupiter ever seen. From a clearer picture of a storm brewing on Jupiter to hidden moons, join us as we jump into Jupiter's extraordinary beauty. Enhancing Jupiter's Splendors When the James Webb Space Telescope, or JWST, took off from French Guiana on December 25, 2021, scientists thought it would take amazing pictures of faraway galaxies and places where stars are being made. And NASA's most important space camera has not let them down. The images captured by the JWST in July 2022 provide a never-before-seen view of Jupiter, showing the largest planet in our solar system in stunning detail. Infrared images from the telescope's NIR cam instrument, particularly in the short wavelength filter, reveal distinct bands encircling the planet. And how can we forget the star of the show, the iconic Great Red Spot, which is a storm so massive it could engulf Earth? M.K. Depata, a planetary astronomer from the University of California, Berkeley, who played a significant role in leading the observation, expressed her awe at the incredible visuals. She emphasized that these images presented a crystal clear perspective on the gas giant, unlike anything seen before. The level of detail and clarity exceeded all expectations. The images, artificially colored by the US-French research team, were carefully enhanced to highlight the distinctive features of the gas giant. To ensure that specific features of Jupiter stood out in the images, the US-French research team employed artificial coloring techniques. Using shades of blue, white, green, yellow, and orange, the team tirelessly enhanced these images making the tiniest details and phenomena on the planet more noticeable. These color changes have made one interesting feature of Jupiter stand out. The Auroras in Display You can see the planet's cloud bands, storms, and something truly captivating, auroral emissions. Just like the colorful northern lights we see on Earth, Jupiter has its version of auroras. They appear as reddish glows near the planet's north and south poles. These auroras are created by ionized hydrogen atoms, which extend up to 625 miles above the clouds. The greenish color around the poles comes from a haze in Jupiter's atmosphere. Hazes are scattered dust, ice, and substances that can reduce visibility. The image also showcases the transitions between different cloud structures around different regions of Jupiter. These phenomena aren't unique to Earth, which is why Earth-bound observers find this feature fascinating. These images are a testament to the incredible capabilities of the JWST and the discoveries it brings us. By studying Jupiter up close, scientists can unlock its secrets and deepen our understanding of this magnificent gas giant. Now, it's not Jupiter that has all our attention. Something is lurking in the background which is just as fascinating. Unveiling Jupiter's Moons in the images revealed, we can see the faint rings around Jupiter, which are much dimmer than the planet itself. Two small moons named Amalthea and Adrastea also make an appearance. Interestingly, there are fuzzy spots in the background which are probably galaxies unintentionally getting in the shot. This single image represents the Jupiter system program, where scientists study Jupiter, its rings, and its moons to learn about their movement and chemistry. Amalthea, about the size of 155 miles in diameter, is positioned farther from Jupiter's limb, while Adrastea, only 12 miles across, can be seen as a faint dot at the edge of the rings. The JWST's wide field view lets scientists investigate Jupiter in detail. They can learn about how it behaves, what elements it contains, and other fascinating things happening in its orbit. By capturing the faint rings and discovering the presence of two small moons, researchers gain valuable insights into Jupiter's complex system. Before we tread on, due thanks should be given to everyone who has helped us understand our planets better. The Citizen Scientists not only professional astronomers, but also regular people known as citizen scientists contribute to the exploration of the JWST's public data archive. Judy Schmidt, 
A skilled image processor from Modesto, California, played a crucial role in enhancing the Jupiter images captured by the James Webb Space Telescope. Despite lacking a formal educational background in astronomy, Schmidt's expertise and passion for image processing have made her an invaluable asset to the scientific community. Working on Jupiter images from JWST presented Schmidt with unique challenges. Due to the planet's rapid rotation, aligning and stacking multiple images to create a coherent view became a complex task. However, with her expertise and digital manipulation techniques, she successfully overcame these challenges, ensuring that the final images accurately portrayed Jupiter's features and characteristics. Judy Schmidt's contribution to the JWST Jupiter images exemplifies the significant role that citizen scientists can play in advancing scientific research. Her dedication, passion, and artistic eye have allowed scientists and the general public to appreciate and understand the beauty and complexities of our universe. Through her collaborative efforts with professional researchers, she has helped uncover new insights about Jupiter and has furthered our understanding of the gas giant's atmosphere and phenomena. Schmidt's journey into the world of astronomical image processing began around a decade ago when she participated in an ESA contest called Hubble's Hidden Treasures. Her image of a newborn star earned her third place out of thousands of submissions. Since then, she has dedicated countless hours to processing data from telescopes like Hubble and has developed a remarkable skill set in transforming raw data into captivating visual representations. So if you're one such individual who wants to take their astronomical ambitions to new heights, look to Judy for inspiration. As for NASA, it's not just Jupiter that they need all the help with. Another shocking discovery has researchers on edge. Super Jupiter Exoplanet The discovery of WASP-18b in 2009 left astronomers amazed, as it is an incredibly unique planet. This massive exoplanet, ten times the size of Jupiter, has some extraordinary characteristics. It is tidally locked to its star, meaning one side always faces the star, and it completes an orbit in less than a day, approximately 23 hours. Recently, astronomers used a powerful instrument of the JWST to observe WASP-18b and map its remarkable atmosphere. This planet has captured the attention of scientists since its discovery for several reasons. First, its massive size places it on the verge of being classified as a brown dwarf rather than a planet. Additionally, WASP-18b is incredibly hot, with temperatures on its day side exceeding a scorching 4,900 degrees Fahrenheit. Interestingly, it is predicted that the planet will eventually spiral towards its star and collide with it within the next one million years. Given these fascinating characteristics, astronomers have been eager to study WASP-18b in detail. Previous efforts using space telescopes like Hubble and Spitzer have provided valuable insights but their data lacked the level of detail needed to fully understand the properties of the planet's atmosphere. The JWST's advanced capabilities and sensitivity make it the ideal instrument to delve into the mysteries of this intriguing, ultra-hot Jupiter. The curiosity and dedication of astronomers to uncover the secrets of WASP-18b demonstrate the immense value of this unique exoplanet in expanding our understanding of planetary systems beyond our own. With the JWST on the case, we can look forward to groundbreaking discoveries and a deeper exploration of the wonders of the universe. Keeping up with discovering more groundbreaking details, the JWST is going to open up more secrets about Jupiter. JWST and the Jupiter Mission The scientists working with the JWST are filled with excitement and optimism about what they can learn from studying Jupiter and its system. They have big plans to analyze various aspects of the planet, such as its cloud layers, composition, temperature, winds, and auroral activity. By gathering this data, they hope to gain a deeper understanding of Jupiter's inner workings. One particular area of interest is Jupiter's ring system. Researchers aim to unravel its mysteries, including its origins and how it might change over time. This knowledge will provide valuable insights into the dynamics of planetary ring systems in general. The JWST's observations will also focus on two of Jupiter's intriguing moons, Io and Ganymede. Io is known for its volcanic activity and scientists hope to create detailed maps of its surface and atmosphere. They will also search for plumes of volcanic gases that are emitted from the moon. 
Ganymede, on the other hand, is an icy moon, and researchers plan to map its surface and atmosphere as well. They will specifically be on the lookout for signs of water vapor, which could reveal fascinating details about the moon's composition. Undoubtedly, these are ambitious goals. However, the JWST's initial observations of Jupiter have shown great promise and have demonstrated that the telescope is more than capable of carrying out this important scientific work. The future looks bright for uncovering discoveries and expanding our knowledge of the Jovian system with the help of the JWST. We'll just have to keep an eye out for more news from JWST. We hope you enjoyed watching this video. If yes, we're sure you would like this next video here. Thanks for watching.